Okay, this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna use this uh, studding punch. It has a spring on, you can adjust harder or stronger and weaker. So, and then basically put it right on the center of the stud and push. Or you can use a hammer. If you have a manual one, you can use a hammer and just stock it in there. But this is the one that's uh, spring loaded. I just made a hole with a studding dot right in the middle of it. Then you would take a drill bit. Make sure to put the safety glasses on. Very important. I hope this will reach. So as you see, we have this control arm, the uh, sway bar in a way. So we're gonna have to use something else to drill that thing straight. So what we're gonna do, let's see if I can do this. This might be a little too long. Got the uh, And put the drill bit right in the middle of it and kind of go slowly. Okay. Gonna change this drill bit, we'll put the bigger drill bit on there. Because this drill bit is a little small. Let's see, it's going. Deeper, we are deep enough. No, no, you're enough. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if we're deep enough. And this is a tool. We're gonna use it. When you buy them, it comes only like this, without this. So I can. I took a little shaft that I have and I melt this on that I can put my screwdriver on top of this and turn it easier. So and we'll see if it's gonna work or I have to drill more. And just keep turning as you see. You gotta go really easy, don't rush in this. It really will, uh, if you'll strip the thing out, then you don't want that to happen. You can't rush, you gotta go real easy. You can't use a screw gun on this thing right over here. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, and just keep turning, you see the way out. Okay. Okay, there you go. So if you see, uh, he never hit the bottom with it. Whoever did it, still nice and smooth in the bottom. But he did, he over tie your head against the oil pan and basically snap off. So. That's how you get the uh, broken bolts out. To start out with a block. Um, they have a couple different sizes in this too. I wouldn't go just to maybe another 30 seconds bigger if you want to, but uh, this, is, uh, this is the way to go. But just make sure you drill it right in the center of the stud and use the punch 
that I showed you previously. Either this punch or use a nail or something to put right on the center of the stud that I was showing originally in the video. So I got the uh, six of them out. Uh, hopefully <clears throat> they won't break anymore. But whoever did this, he obviously didn't have a clue what is he doing. He did not use a uh, torque wrench uh, <clears throat> to set proper torque on there. He basically, who knows what he used, just keep tying, 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 and all the way till they don't snap with no actually reason. All the uh, pan gaskets sealing around with the, just a little bit of the pressure. They really don't need any overtie. Just the uh, best way is to use a torque wrench. Thanks for watching guys.